Let's go through Nichols. I don't know what you want. Over a cud, over a Oh, sweet! Yeah, this year, so we flip it over like that. The Benjamin! A-N-A, oh no. Silver quarter from 19... Hello everyone and welcome to Numis Nate. I'll be hunting boxes 22 and 23 on the year in Nichols, and they are from different facilities. This one is actually from the same facility as the one where we got the V nickel. So let's see if this one is just as good as last time. Roll three, and we have our first find of this box from 1941, Philadelphia. And speaking of 1941s, roll 32 is a 1941 ender. Roll four. And we have a 1954 from Philadelphia. Roll six, and we have a 1959 Jefferson Nickel from Denver. Roll seven, and we have yet another 1954 Nickel from Denver. This time. Roll nine has two finds. First, a 1953 Been Through the Ringer from Denver. And then our second find is a 1941 Jefferson from Philly. Roll 12, and we have a 1958 from Denver. Roll 16, and we have a 1948 from Philadelphia. Roll 17, and we have a 1954, pretty dirty, from Denver. Roll 18, and we have a 1948 from Philadelphia. Roll 19, and we have a 1939 from Philadelphia. Roll 21, and we have a 1956 from Philadelphia. Roll 22 has two finds. First, a 1956 from Denver, and then the Ender coin was a 1954 from San Francisco. Roll 23, and we've got two more finds. First, a 1952 from Philadelphia. And then a few coins back, we have a 1949 from Denver. Oh, nope, that's a Philadelphia mint. Roll 29 has two finds. First, a stingy 1954 from Philadelphia, and then the Ender coin was a 1940 from Philadelphia. Roll 30, and we have a 1940 from Philly. Roll 31, and we have two finds once again. We have a 1952 from Denver, show the obverse again, and then we have a Buffalo nickel, reverse facing, from 1936. Roll 32, and you guys know the deal. We have an Ender coin from 1941, and it is actually a Fidel of Philadelphia. Roll 34, and this box is doing pretty good. We have a 1938 Jefferson Nickel first year from Philadelphia. Very nice. Roll 36, and we have a 1959 from Denver. All right, box 22 came to an abrupt end, and it wasn't actually that bad. We got a 38, 39, and a buffalo, and all of this good stuff. No silver, unfortunately, but hopefully box 23 has some. Roll four, and our first find is silver, which is crazy, because I have been begging for silver since the end of first box. Let's see what year it is. 1944. Roll 10, and we have a 1940 from Philadelphia. Roll 12, and we have another 1940, this time from Denver. Roll 14, and we have a 1946 from Philadelphia. Same roll, roll 14, and we have a 1957 from Denver. Roll 24, and we have a 1948 from Philadelphia. Roll 28, and we have a 1946 from Philadelphia. Roll 29, and we have a 1958 from Denver. Roll 41, and we have a 1955 from Denver. Roll 42 has two finds. First, a 1959 from Philly, and then in the back of the roll, a 1954, pretty nice, from Denver. 
Roll 44, and we have a 1957 from Denver. Roll 46, and we have a 1939 at Jefferson Nickel from Philadelphia. Roll 48 has two finds. First, a 1959 from Denver, and then we have a Canadian Nickel from 1983. Roll 49 has multiple finds. First, a 1956 from Denver, and then a 1952 from Philadelphia, and then a 1939 from Philadelphia. Last roll of the box, and we have a 1946 from Philadelphia. I'll bring it back with a wrap-up. All right, box 23 is done, and it was pretty good. We got some normal finds, a Canadian, two 39s, and a silver. Thank you so much for watching, and have a wonderful day. Love the silver war nickels.